So, you want to create your own RPG? Well, RPG Playground makes this really easy for you. After you log in, you see this small demo game. It's entirely made with RPG Playground. So, let me show you how you can create something like that yourself. If you click the button on the top left, it will open the project pane. Here you can create or modify your game. Now, we could modify this demo game, but let's start afresh. So, let's go to the world tab and press the new button. Now that we have an empty game, let's add some objects. So, let's go to the scenery tab and select an object. If you drag your mouse, you can select multiple types. Let's add this object to the game. Let's add another one there. Now, you can also select other objects, this tree for example. RPG Playground will handle placing objects in front or behind each other. So let's create a small forest here, like that. Okay. So now that we have some scenery, let's add some characters. Click on the Actors tab and select the character that you want to add. Place it in the level like this. Let's add another character. Okay, now we can change the orientation of these characters by pressing the settings button. Let's let them face each other. Okay. Now the first character is named Entity1 and the second one is named Entity2. If you take a look at the talk behavior, you can see that the hero will say hello and the Entity2 will say hi. Now we want to adapt this screenplay, but first let's give our actors a real name. So let's name this one mom and the other one dad. Okay, and now let's adapt the screenplay of the mom. So let's erase everything that's here now. Okay, so first dad says let's go to town. Mom says no, I still have work to do. And then the hero that says, says, hi, mom. And then mom says, hi. Okay, screenplay is okay. Now let's test it. Let's close the project pane and let's walk over to mom. Okay, and now you can see the screenplay is playing right now. Dad says, let's go to town. Mom says, no, I still have work to do. Then you say, hi, mom. And then she says, hi. So now that we have a small game, let's save it. Go back to the project pane. Go to the world tab and press save. Here we can save it on an already existing uh, entry, but let's create a new one. Let's name it awesome. Okay. So now we have saved the project and then afterwards we could load it again. Here it is. Or you could share this game with your friends. Just press the share button and then you can share it on Twitter, Facebook or Google+. Or you can just send them the link and they will be able to play your game. So this should get you started on creating your own RPG. Now go and try it for yourself and have fun.